Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning into today's video. Um, I feel like I'm one of those YouTubers, like, you know how YouTubers usually come on camera and they're just all done up and like, they got a new outfit on, face geek to the gods, beautiful background scenery. I feel like I'm just like, I, I just don't have it in me to be pretty on camera all the time I mean my natural beauty is enough of course <laughs> but yeah I just don't have it in me to like just get all done up to show y'all simple basic tutorials I don't know like do y'all want to see me like all I mean I feel like I be getting done up though sometimes but like I don't know I feel like I really just be chilling like y'all will see me in a t-shirt the same t-shirt that I probably done wore two years ago in a video and just my natural face because Sometimes I just don't be feeling like doing all of that rah-rah. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just want to come as you are. You just want to come as you are to your subscribers and be like, this is what I look like in real life. And, you know, it's not all, I'm not always picture perfect. I'm not always made up, done up. I be tired. Doing makeup all the time, like doing makeup is tiring. It's time consuming. And it's just not necessary, especially when you're black. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, thank you for tuning into this video. So I will be showing you guys how I am maintaining my faux locks. I'll be showing you how I'm preserving my real hair and how I'm maintaining my real hair and promoting growth. Um, what products I'm using to promote growth and to just soothe my scalp when it does get all itchy and because uh, right now it, oh, <laughs> I'm not even a month in and my scalp is going crazy okay so i'll just be walking you guys through my nighttime routine for my faux locks all right so i'm going to go through the products first just to show you guys what i use why i use it and then i'm going to show you my routine okay so what i use first oh and the bottle is all beat up hold on i have used this for almost every like braid or lock protective style and it's jamaican mango and lime mentholated no more itch grow spray maximum relief now this product is literally a lifesaver if you're one of those people who has a sensitive scalp or like you have a really itchy scalp and you're like beating your head this is going to save you this can soothe oh my gosh Talk about soothing, this product soothes all the itch and irritation that comes from just scratching your scalp, um, itchy scalp when your hair's been in, in a protective style for a while and you have buildup or, you know, my scalp is used to being washed literally like every two weeks or every other week. Um, so the fact that, so when I am in protective styles, it really does act up and the itchies go crazy. So definitely Jamaican Mango and Lime is always on my list, you guys. Definitely try it out for yourself. So it says, helps soothe itchy and dry scalp, non-greasy formula, helps, helps prevent breakage, great for locks, twists, and braids. And all you have to do is just spray it on your scalp and that is it, okay? So next up, I actually use the same product that I use to braid down my hair for the locks. And this is the Blue Magic Indian Hemp. So basically what I do is I just grease my scalp. You guys know what that is. That's old school when you your mama parts through your hair and greases, you know, every bit of your scalp. I just go through and I grease in between my parts with this Blue Magic. And you guys, the, the, the growth spray, the No More Itch Growth Spray, and then the hair grease combination. You guys already know I'm going back to using hair grease because... Of its benefits the way that it prevents breakage and sometimes just the old school products we should have never left them in the first place okay as naturals we should have never left the old school products all this new new stuff it's, it's just not doing it so I'm going back to blue magic but yes blue magic really helps natural hair grow you guys like you guys can look it up on YouTube YouTube University like blue magic is it when it comes to hair growth and black hair okay period so next up, I've been using Tailored Beauty's Grow Thick Oil. So yes, I'm trying to grow because you guys know I got that trim back in, what was that, March? Got a trim back, in, was that March? I think it was March. And, um, was that March? It was, yes, it was March. Okay, no, was that April? I don't know when it was, but I got a trim recently and I'm just doing protective styles. I had the tapins in, so I'm using products that are growth based and I'm using Taylor Beauty's Grow Thick Oil for longer, stronger, healthier hair. 
So the growth thick oil helps reduce split ends and scalp problems that can cause hair loss. Packed with vitamins and omegas that aid hair growth, protects the hair from everyday damage that causes dryness and breakage. So it has castor oil, sesame seed oil, avocado oil, apricot oil, vitamin E oil, and rosemary oil. I've only got a little bit left, but it's going to be used on the scalp, okay? Alright, and so once I apply all of those, then I take a foam. So I've been using Cream of Nature's um, Style and Shining Foaming Mousse. And I've just been putting a layer of that on and then once that's on, once all my products are on, I just slap on my scarf and keep it pushing. Okay, so now I'm going to just do my routine on camera so you guys can see how I do it. All right, so it is a lot of hair, so I kind of have to separate it and split it up a bit. <laughs> but I start in the back, and I spray my spray first. I make sure to get completely around. So when I do this, I make sure to get completely all of my edges from back all the way to front has to be sprayed. So don't neglect those areas. It's good to get in the parts, but make sure you're getting the... Um, what is it, the outline of your hair as well. Alright, so once I have that part sprayed, then I take my Blue Magic and I go ahead and just kind of feel around. You can't see the back of your head, so I just kind of grease my fingers and I just feel the parts in the back. And this Blue Magic smells so good. So does the Jamaican Mango and Lime. Alright, so once I use those two products, then I move on. We're going to save the oil and the foam for when our hair is completely, when our scalp is completely greased and sprayed. Also, you can kind of feel around and feel like where, what's damp after you've sprayed it. If you kind of like lose your place or you just have too much hair to keep up with. Like I know y'all see me struggling. It's a hassle, but I got to do it. It's a hassle, but the style is cute, and I just got to maintain my hair. All right, so now I'm going in with the Blue Magic, feeling around on my scalp. It doesn't have to be super, you don't have to get every single row and every box. Like, Just kind of place your product. All right, so now that that's done, we're gonna go ahead and oil our scalp. And I do this um, when I'm done with greasing my scalp because you know, oil drips, it'll all just drip down. So I don't need to do too much work when applying this oil. All right, so now that our first three products are applied, it's time to add our mousse. So I just take a glob. And we wanna add hydration. Ooh, when your scalp is dry, this. And of course, water. You guys can always just spray your scalp with water on the daily, especially in protective styles. Thank you. 
All right, once my products are applied, it's time to tie it all down and go to bed. <laughs> All right, so that is my nighttime routine. Super simple, easy way to pr protect, preserve, hydrate, grow your hair in your protective style. You guys cannot neglect your hair in a protective style. It's only protective if you are maintaining it. So make sure you guys add your moisture, add your hydration. Also, when I go to the gym, I need to do a um, post-gym lock tutorial. But when I go to the gym, these locks are so long, they pick up the scent. You feel me? They pick up s smell. So I literally have to shampoo my locks every other day. Um, and I'm not worried about my hair. My hair is braided inside. So I'm not worried about my hair um, knotting up or actually really locking up. <laughs> um, because I do add my products which then seep down. Okay? So, and also I'm adding water to my hair constantly. When I'm shampooing it, water is constantly being put onto my ends, onto my strands. So yeah, definitely make sure you are hydrating your hair in your protective style. Um, you can choose to sleep in a bonnet or not. Some nights I sleep with the bonnet and some nights I just can't be bothered because it messes with your neck just a little bit. It's a lot of hair, you guys. It's really a lot of hair. Um, but yeah, to each his own, whatever helps you, whatever you feel most, most comfortable doing, um, then do that. So thank you guys for tuning into this video. Um, if you have any questions, definitely drop them below. I'll be happy to answer. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe, like, um, drop your questions below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.